The teaching fraternity today gathered at Kololo Independence Grounds for the National Teachers' Day celebrations. President Yoel Museveni presided over the event. While officiating at the celebrations, Museveni commended the teachers for their tireless efforts on educating the nation. The president also applauded Vision Group for the Teachers Making a Difference initiative, where the best 12 teachers were awarded. Also congratulate the teachers who are organized. The 12. So that means there are some good teachers in Uganda. This is because Mr. Wanyama described the process that the nominations come from from the people. They are the ones who nominate, who say, ah, our teacher is a good one. And then Wanyama's group here goes through working with the experts. They go and cross-check the information. And then they come out with the most outstanding. So I, could, I really congratulate you and I congratulate all those teachers who are doing their best. President Museveni further gave confidence to the teachers that their demands for salary enhancement will be considered but in a phased manner. He advised teachers to stop pressurizing the government over salaries. The First Lady, who is also the Minister for Education, Janet Kataha Museveni, explained the delay for teachers to receive their COVID-19 relief funds. She blamed it on disorganization. We've been trying to get this money to the private schools and teachers from the COVID-19 time. We have discussed this. You know how many times I sat with you personally and discussed how we can help you access this money. It went back and forth. Our permanent secretary is here and could give you all the details, but really, I don't think we need to go into that. But what I needed to say is that that money has been there in the Ministry of Finance. It, the problem had been you are organizing yourself to, to, to access this money. That's the problem. The General Secretary of the Ugandan National Teachers Union, Philbert Baguma, thanked the government for its tremendous work towards the education sector. I appreciate the Minister of Education and Sports for putting in place the Education Policy Review Commission. We have high hopes that it will go a long way to capture views and ideas which when implemented will transform education in our country. The Chief Executive Officer of Vision Group, Don Wanyama, commended teachers for their service and expounded more on the Teachers Making a Difference project. Download the app on App Store or Google Play Store now. Vision Digital Experience, the future of media.